Avid Media Composer Tutorial How to Add or Apply Effects Here I have a sequence already created. I added a few clips on a few different video layers that I am going to use for this example. Let's start here in the effects palette. I'll grab a commonly used sapphire effect. The film effect. If you don't have the sapphire effect plugins, that's okay this will work with almost all effects. Next I'll just click on the film effect and drag and drop on the clip in the sequence I want to affect. I'll now drop the effect on multiple clips in the sequence. All the effects have a small blue dot or a yellow dot next to them. The blue indicates that that effect needs to be rendered. The yellow dots mean that it is a real-time effect and should play without being rendered. Let me remove one of the effects and I'll add a real-time yellow dot effect to the sequence. Now I'll press play and you can see how the real-time effect plays through and the blue dot effect needs to be rendered and will stutter. Now I'll remove all the effects. I will lasso to select all the clips I want. Another way to select the clips you want is to use the red arrow. The red arrow is the segment mode, lift or override tool. By holding shift you can click on each one you want to select. Then I will go back into the effect palette. Now with the multiple clips selected I will double click on the effect I want to apply to all the clips. Now you can see I've add the effect to all the clips that were selected. Let me remove all the effects. I will now apply an effect I have saved in the bin. Like before I will just drag the effect from the bin and drop it onto the clips I want to be affected. Now all the clips have the same effect on it. Let me remove all the effects again. I will select all the clips again. From the bin, I will now double click on the saved effect and apply it to all the clips I have selected. Now the effect is on all the clips in the sequence. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.